welcome back to Immaculate Wealth. We can try to get you to your first million early before, at least before 30. All right, Building Wealth in Tough Times, Blueprint for Personal and Social Impact. Uh, wealth creation is a powerful tool for personal and societal transformation. Building wealth enables you to support causes and people beyond your immediate family. Financial independence allows you to take calculated risks and pursue meaningful work. Accumulating wealth is a form of self-reliance that reduces burden on social systems. Creating wealth often means creating jobs and opportunities for others. Financial success puts you in a position to mentor and invest in the next generation Wealth building is about creating long-term value, not just accumulating money. Economic downturns present unique opportunities for wealth creation. Building wealth can provide a platform for influencing positive social change. Financial success allows you to invest in innovative solutions to societal problems. Wealth creation is a skill that can be learned and improved over time. Building wealth is about growing the economic pie, not just taking a larger slice. Economic uncertainty makes many people hesitant or reluctant to invest or take financial risk. Inflation erodes the value of savings, making wealth accumulation challenging. Job insecurity in tough economic times can derail wealth building efforts. High cost of living in many areas make it difficult to save and invest. A lack of financial education leaves many unequipped to build wealth effectively. Economic downturns can lead to a scarcity mindset hindering wealth creation. Volatile markets can make traditional investment strategies seem unreliable. Debt burdens, especially student loans, impede many from building wealth. Don't I know it. Societal pressure to consume rather than save works against wealth. Wealth accumulation. Generational wealth gaps make it harder for some to get started on wealth building. Rapidly changing technology and markets can make long-term planning difficult. In a later video, we'll discuss how it can help. But misconceptions about wealth often lead to ineffective financial strategies. So some ways to combat this. Develop multiple streams of income. Diversify your earnings through investments, 
side work, passive income sources, build resilience against economic fluctuations. Now, this could work, but more effectively is you want to get think you want to get good at one thing so good that it does increase help you increase uh, the the money the funds you have available then you can distribute out to other investments You gotta find which one works for you, but the filling up of one cup, having it overflow to diversify seems to be what really works. All right, embrace value investing. Look for undervalued assets during economic downturns focusing on companies with strong fundamentals and long-term potential. Invest in yourself. Continuously upgrade your skills or upskill and increase your knowledge. That will also increase your earning potential and adaptability in changing job markets. Practice strategic frugality, cut costs on non-essentials while investing in assets and experiences that bring long-term value or growth. Build an emergency fund, establish a robust savings cushion to weather economic uncertainties and avoid derailing your wealth building progress. Leverage technology. Use digital platforms for learning, investing, and building businesses with lower overhead costs. Network strategically. Build relationships with mentors, peers, and potential partners who can provide opportunities and insights for wealth creation. Think globally. Explore international markets and opportunities that may be thriving even when your local economy is struggling. Invest in real assets. Consider investments like real estate or commodities that can serve as hedges against inflation and economic instability. Start a business that solves problems. Identify needs created by economic challenges and build ventures to address them. Create, creating value for yourself and others. Practice long-term thinking. Develop a wealth building strategy that looks beyond current economic conditions to long-term trends and opportunities. Give strategically as you build wealth, implement a giving strategy that creates opportunities for others, potentially through education, microloan, or mentorship programs. All right. So something you could probably do right now. So identify one new income stream you can develop and take the first step this week. Research and invest in one company you believe is undervalued in the current market. Sign up for a course or workshop to upgrade a valuable skill in your field. Review your budget and identify three areas where you can cut costs without sacrificing quality of life. Open a high-yield savings account 
and set up automatic transfers for your emergency fund. Join an online community or forum focused on wealth building and financial education. Reach out to someone whose financial success you admire and ask for a virtual coffee chat. Or virtual chat. Research one in international market or opportunity, and you could potentially, or opportunity you could potentially tap into. Explore local real estate opportunities or REITs, real estate investment trusts, as potential investments. Brainstorm three business ideas that address current economic challenges. Create a 10-year wealth building plan laid out. 10-year wealth building plan focus on focusing on long-term trends and goals. I would also create a 5-year plan and you know it'll It'll be like a milestone and then continue on to that the next five years for the total 10 years. All right, and don't forget to check out our five-day money mindset course to align your wealth-building strategies with a purposeful financial mindset. All right, thank you for listening. Hopefully you got some value out of this. Like, share, subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.